In this video, we are going to find all natural numbers n such that n squared minus 5n plus 5 all to the power n squared minus n minus 2 equals 1. Before we move on, don't forget to give a like, subscribe to my channel, and turn on post notifications. There are actually only three cases where we can have a perfect power to be equal to 1. The first case is that the base is 1. 1 to some numbers equals 1. And the second case is some number that is non-zero, very important, non-zero, to the power 0 equals 1. And the third case is that minus 1 all to the power of some even number was also equal to 1. So these are the only three possible cases. Now for the first case, because we, have the, we want the base to be 1, so that means n squared minus 5n plus 5 has to be 1. And that means n squared minus 5n plus 4 equals 0. We can factorize and find that n has to be 1 or 4. And of course, um, when n is 1 and 4, n squared minus n minus 2 are uh, legit numbers. So 1 to the power of that is surely equal to 1. Now for the second case, because we want the index to be 0, so that means n squared minus n minus 2 equals 0. Then we can factorize again and realize that n has to be minus 1 or 2. Now for this case, we notice that n squared minus 5n plus 5 has no integral solution. So in particular, uh, no matter whether you put minus 1 or 2 into this part, you will not get 0. So we're all good. Finally, for minus 1 to some even powers, then that means we have to find n such that n squared minus 5n plus 5 equal to minus 1. And that means n squared minus 5n plus 6 has to be 0. And then we can factorize. And eventually, n has to be 2 or 3. Now, this, is, this, this case is a bit complicated because we have to check whether n squared minus n minus 2 is also even. Now, when n minus 2, n squared minus n minus 2 is actually 0, and when n equals 3, n squared minus n minus 2 is actually equal to 4. So, this time we are lucky. Both solutions will work. And altogether, we have actually have five solutions. Notice that these two actually repeated itself. So therefore, n can be minus 1, 1, 2, 3, and 4. And that's our final answer. I hope you enjoyed the video. Feel free to suggest any alternatives in the comments. If you like my videos, make sure to subscribe to my channel right now. Thank you for your support. See you next time.